Hi everybody, it's Karen from Crafty Karen Designs here. Welcome to Fun Fall Friday. And I think we're on week 47. Something like that. Almost a year anyway. I'm really quite proud of that. I never thought I'd be able to keep going this long with this. But um, I am trying to think of something new for the, ne for the, next, um, the next year or so. But we'll see. Anyway, I hope you've all had um, a lovely Christmas and a great new year and let's hope 2021 is better than 2020 has been um you should have all if you're my customers anyway you should have all, all had your mini catalogue and your celebration brochure by now i hope you're enjoying it um if there's anything you want to chat about just drop me a message there's some lovely stuff in here and some really nice free stuff um and today i'm going to use one of the Designer series papers out of here, but I'm going to use stamp sets from the annual catalog. Oh, one from the annual catalog and one from here. So let me show you what we're going to make. Here we go. Not quite sure what this one's called. Um, so I'm just calling it an ice cream corner because that's the name of the designer series paper. An ice cream corner, um, fun fold card. And it opens up like that and you can write message inside it's a really quick and easy one but looks quite effective with lots of different sorts of DSP um, so let me talk you through it you need a piece of designer series paper Oops, let's get rid of these little fussy cut bits I've cut those out in advance so I don't bore you to death um, this is eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths and we need to score it in half to make a card base so we'll score that at four and one eighth and we've also got a strip that needs to be scored this is one inch by five and seven eighths so we'll score that at two and seven eighths too that one doesn't have to be exactly in the middle, just near enough. So, get my bone folder, just fold those. Now at the moment, Stampin' Up! have got a really good deal on um, if you want to join and become a demonstrator. Um, and you don't have to do videos and blogs and everything you can just join to get the discount which is 20% which is quite a good discount um, at the moment you can have £130 worth of goods out of either of the catalogues for £99 free post and packing all the bits and pieces needed to get you going if you wanted to be a demonstrator catalogues and things like that um, <clears throat> but you don't ever have to sell if you don't want to um, but as well as that, they're offering five packs of free design series paper. And it's I haven't got any yet. It's the background paper that comes in all the colours that we do. So something like 50 different colours of um, background paper. Let me show you some of this year's. Um, just bear with me a minute. This was the sort of thing this year we had. I think it was four different patterns in all of the colours and it's really useful as um, background paper or you can just put a sentiment on top of it and there you've got a really quick and easy card so I haven't actually seen it yet um, in person so I'm not sure what the patterns are but I'm sure it will be great anyway let's get on with this so this piece is going to stick to the back of here and overlap the front like that. So what you need to do is hang it over the front piece like that and then just put some glue on the back. Or you can use stamp and seal or tear and tape or anything like that. And turn it round and just judge it by eye. Well, I'm just judging it by eye. Whereabouts is in the middle. So 
sorry I'm a bit ham fisted today and then just fold it down and press it and you can open it up and then just press that down and then that will fold over that okay So the next, um, the design series paper I'm going to put on the front of here. Let me show you some of the others. Because I didn't show you that, did I? Um, the one I used on this one, let me grab it, is um, a nice stripe with lots of different colours in it. Uh, I've only got a sample of this. I haven't got a full pack. So we've got ice cream cones. And then on the back of that, we've got like, um, looks like the waffle cone. And then different sorts of ice cream cones. And on the back of that is what I'm using here. This hundreds and thousands. And then there's lots of these sort of colour wash things. It's nice stripes. Oh, different colour wash with some wavy lines. These are great background papers. This is the one I used on the other um, on the other card. In the back of that had lollipops on. And I really like this one. I like the colours in that one. On the back of that we've got some spots. And I like the colours on this one too. Again, wavy lines. Um, that's all I've got of that because I only had a I did a paper share with some demonstrators friends so we all had a little bit of everything to, to um, get us going with the new catalogue so this piece is three and seven eighths by five and five eighths so we're just going to put this on the front of the card you could put another mat underneath this as well if you wanted to I decided not to just put that in the center I'll leave a nice border all the way around the outside there we go and then we'll do some stamping put the lid on that and it doesn't dry up so I'm going to use Bermuda Bay because that's the color of the cardstock and I'm going to use um, many mates and the other one I put it's your day I think I might put happy birthday on this one on the front and then inside I put this calls for a huge celebration I think it's a really good all-round um, stamp set this one and I like this this outline effect because you can colour it in as well if you want to and then the little um, starburst came off this oval occasions which comes with um, a punch and if you buy the two together nice oval punch you buy the two together it's 10% off which is really good love a punch so let's stamp this on this piece this piece for the inside is three and seven eighths by five and five eighths so we'll just stamp that in the middle and have some of these little starbursts just over the top there we go and then on this one I said I was going to change it didn't I, for happy birthday so let's find the happy birthday So this um, is one of the stitched scallops rectangles and this measures approximately two and a half by three and a half. So I'm going to put this, stamp this about two thirds up from the bottom. We'll have some more of those little stars over the top. There we go. And then I fussy cut some of the ice creams and lollies 
I'm going to stick these on here with dimensionals but I'm going to mount it first on this um, another stitched rectangle scallop rectangle which is about three by four so we'll glue that to there first You could put it on dimensionals if you wanted to. I thought I'd uh, leave it flat and put the ice creams on the dimensionals. And then we'll add this to the inside. Just leave a nice border all the way around the outside. There we go. And then what I did, I put some glue on this bit here and then positioned that over the top so it's in the middle. It's about in the middle. give that a press and then we'll get some dimensionals I've been cutting up all around the edge of these I don't think I've got enough here I might have to um, crack open a new pack and that'll fit on that one oh, just about enough rid of that now. So put one lolly over this way, hanging over the edge a bit. And we'll put the corner in the middle. I wonder what flavour this ice cream's supposed to be. Looks like it might be berry flavoured, doesn't it? There we go. How quick and easy was that? There we are. Got two cute cards. Really easy. There we go. Hope you like them. I hope you give me a thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed to the channel, I'd be really grateful if you could. If you click on the bell on the um, red subscribe button below this video um, and press on the bell and you'll get notified every time I upload a new video. All the instructions and the measurements will be over on my blog craftycarandesigns.blogspot.com and don't forget if you're interested in um, joining my team or any of the products just you can buy the products by going to my blog and clicking on the link for the online shop and if you're interested in becoming a demonstrator and part of my team, I'd be really I'd be really happy to have you with me. And um, just send me a message. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you again soon. Bye.